Hi, after watching this video, please choose a similar subject to paint and just follow the steps that I take to guide you through your painting process. And remember, always enjoy what you are doing and good luck! This video shows you the steps that I take working on my paintings. I use Prismacolor pencils and a picture to paint from. The first step I take is I create an outline. The outline is made in graphite pencil and it is very light. Then I tap the lines with a kneaded eraser to make them lighter. I pick indigo blue pencil and make the outlines. I begin coloring within those outlines. I keep my pencil very sharp. It helps me to keep the lines nice and crisp. I fill in all the shadows with a single indigo blue pencil. Here's the result. I choose several blue pencils and start coloring. I employ cross-hatching a lot to get rid of extra lines and keep the entire drawing smooth. I then work with yellows. I keep outlining the lines and then coloring around them. I apply Tuscan Red over Indigo Blue. I work on lighter blues to create the sense of light. I cover the shadow of the flower with darker blue, so it becomes part of the background, not the flower itself. I add peachy colors over the blues. I do a lot of cross henching once again. I keep looking at my picture to compare my values and see what part needs to get lighter and what side needs to get darker. In this step, I use a very small brush. I dip it into the mineral spirits or turpanoid and I start painting over my first layer of color. This way I get rid of any textures in the drawing and I have very nice smooth and dark layer of color. 
Here you can see how the mineral spirits melt the wax in the pencils. I begin coloring the bottom part of the drawing. Again I use a combination of light pencils before I apply white over those to create a nice colorful undertone. White pencil is the last one I use to create highlights. It's important to keep the lines nice and straight, so use the ruler to help you with that. I apply white over a bunch of other colors. I also use Prismacolor Colorless Blender to smooth out the lighter parts of my drawing. After applying the mineral spirits or tamponoid, I let the paper dry and after it is dry, I start coloring once again. I use dark green over the indigo blue to color the pot. I add lighter parts in the board with lilac. I let two colors blend, so I do a lot of overlapping when I color.